so hey guys welcome back in video mangla yt and another part of our pubg type gaming king and sorry for the last video because that video has become very short uh, because my brother's come and he just gave me some work to do that's why so first of all let me show uh let me show you what i did in the last video so in the last video i basically setting the animation for the jump so uh, what i did that on the jump jump section i add a using m416 with verify note that if then if it's if i using the m4 so i play the m416 with jump animation if i not so i just play my ideal uh, basics the third person ideal jumping animation and for a uh, back from coming this animation to our standard animation i just added delay time that is the basic duration of this both animation that is a 1.27 milliseconds so then after that completing the 1.20 milliseconds uh, what i did basically stop the uh, and i just stop this animation and uh, set up my basics uh, animation which one we have okay like our basic like, locomotions okay so at here as you can see that is uh, pretty much enough good at here so now let's uh, fix some bugs so first of all first one bugs is if you check that our this bag is quite low and this position so for first of all i will be change the position so just open your skeletons and then uh, you can preview with the animation so at here let me preview with the idle animation that is basically the iron side idle or uh, this one so as you can see we can see probably that how it's looking so first of all i fix for the bugs for uh, the backpack so simply search a uh, bag bag and we found the bag and then once you find the bag you need to just adjust this thing nothing else yeah we need to just just this thing so now it's your choice that how you will do so now we are going to just do some kind of like a pubg that is just like that inside of our you know i don't know what it's called in our back so we can basically change the scale also depends on the situation so i'm just also doing the same thing now i have a question though bro for the backpack the basically Uh, for the backpack let's first of all let me check that it's change our backpack uh, picking or not yep it's quite enough uh fix this thing so now as you can see this is uh as you can see from these parts you can see more goodly but once we pick the weapons and we change uh, check as you can see we find the gaps also so we can basically easily understand that how we need to set up the bags okay so now just go to this view and as you can see there's a super gap inside of this thing so let me first of all we'll be go in rotate mode and then just simply do like this thing just simply adjust how much as possible for us so once we set like this thing so now it's time to set up for the gun so just search the guns and that is our gun one so basically what i want that it show goodly uh, everyone because our m4 is uh, too much cool that's why so uh will be set like mm, we can set like this okay kind of like this so basically just get this thing like that and just once we adjust this thing on this position so it will be look like this thing okay so if you want you can make like this thing okay on these sides or you can basically rotate it okay like the pubg style like how pubg set up like this thing okay you can also do so just let's also let make the similar like the pubg because we are copying nothing else okay i think that is pretty much enough at here now let's try the ping so as you can see now picking will be attached at here if i pick the backpack so it will be look like this thing okay so it's now looking like this thing so i think it, it's looking more great so i'm not i'm not sure what's about you but i think in my case it's uh, looking very uh, quite enough good so really i, I really like this so once you uh we are already fixed the uh basically just change some stuff okay 
so it's uh, looking quite and uh, good not so much bad okay uh, for our back pages have uh, become some sites no problem so then uh, we if you and we can attach some more weapons so just think that in your day are uh, in a wall okay there's a uh, two weapons available so uh, what is the basically problem that uh, it will be pick up the both gun in a same stock okay so for fixing this thing that if you have we can only limitation we need to make a limitation a yeah, that uh, only we can pick the two guns so first of all what i do i will be do the same thing for the gun stock uh, i'll be simply duplicate this thing okay so simply just so we can't duplicate this thing no problem so we can basically go to spin arm and just click on add a stock and we give our stock name that gun uh, b2 okay gun b2 that is basically our stock number two so we'll be do the same thing that preview assets then we'll be search that the un and there should be our guns comes yep it's come so as you can see this uh this thing is come but don't worry so you need to just search the gun and it should be already display okay so now what you need to do basically just copy the whole data of this one so that that is the a reactive rotation just copy come at here and just paste this thing so it will be automatically adjust and for the basically scale we'll be do the same thing for this stock okay so once we uh, set up this stock we need to just go to up so you, you can also make the camera some slower so get a better control so yeah I think that is good So we have now the two guns in two different uh, place. Okay, so one is looking like this, one is looking. So let me just rotate this thing because I think we need some rotation. So uh, yeah, as you can see, that is a uh, pretty much enough at here. So we can basically we can adjust this thing. So now basically we have the two stocks. Okay, uh, so first of all we need to go in our picking system so in our that is our pick verify system so at here what will we do we'll create another integer a another integer uh no only one integer that uh w a weapon number oh sorry w a w a p n weapon and u m number that is uh, integer compile and saved and then what will we do if uh, at here that on the picking system uh, we need now some space why we need some space so let me tell you because we are going to add one more stock at here that's why so at here first of all it will be by default it will be go at here but now because we we, we want that number two number stock so simply what i do duplicate this thing and paste it here basically our gun stock name that is the gun 2 now you have a question bro how we can set up the automatic that if we already have the gun stock number 2 so the gun uh, number you know that gun number 2 will be picked so let me show you first of all it will be verify basically the number that what is the basically the value right now okay so just think that if we have the num uh sorry if uh we have equals that is uh zero so if it's true so it's been that we don't have any gun so if do if we don't have any gun so basically we can pick a gun so that is basically number this ones okay the first one will be done so that we will be get an integer value called one okay because we have a one gun right now but if it's false so it will be just uh, add a stock in basically in this position okay so just false connected with this stock and then all the reference will be same the target the pattern okay everything will be uh, uh, same even uh, this one is also i have a m4 uh it's also should be true okay so at here the weapon number will be changed now at here the weapon number will be become 
uh, basically the two because that is the basically his ID number is true. So we have now this system. If it's uh, zero, so then it will be picked this one. So uh, on if it's false, if it's not zero, it means there is a one value. So it will be basically execute this one. It will be put the value two. Okay. So now if I click on play and if I click on pick, so we have this thing and the second time it will be pick this thing okay as you can see the system is working but here is there's also one more problem if we have number three number gun so what happened because we have the limitation of two gun weapon picking so if i click now pick so it will be pick first time the second time this one will come so will be pick so it's come now what is with third number two it will be pick also but the problem is right now we have we want to give the limitation only the two gun picking so what i do right now at here before executing this one it will be verify here one more thing okay so we need some more space yeah so basically we need super space so let me just make it some space and just get this thing at here and now with that basically I verify one more time that with true with true that if our this value the weapon number value is get uh basically get at then a zero okay i i have some confusion in zero and basically uh two okay so if we have the value of two so it's mean that we don't can't pick more than value so if it's uh two okay so just uh, if it's false so we can basically pick let me try this function no problem if it's not work also okay uh, guys let me come Ah, oh, sorry, I'm just come. Ah, oh, sorry. So basically for creating uh, let me check because we create that system now we can pick two guns then the three number will be not pick yep so basically it's working if we have uh get a uh get a than zero uh, two uh, guns so we can't pick as you can see uh we can't pick any gun okay because we have the limitation of two so it's not possible to pick uh, more gun okay so basically it's working right now